Hey there all you filthy heathens, this is Kurt coming back to you again. Like I said, I'm just going to be dropping videos every couple of hours until it's time for bed for me. Um, so I wanted to highlight something really quick. It's, um, it's kind of near and dear to me because I've competed in the sport, uh, amateur, amateur level. I have, uh, I know people who have competed professionally, even, uh, you know, fought for UFC titles, fought for major organizations, uh, in MMA. So, uh, if you are a, uh, a fan of mixed martial arts, uh, you should know Big John McCarthy, uh, the former referee, probably the best referee in the history of the sport. Uh, he was actually, uh, um, he posted on his Twitter today and I saw it on YouTube as well. Uh, he was attacked by a tree. So, uh, I, uh, I looked into it a little bit. Looks like he has some cracked ribs or some broken ribs and a collapsed lung, but it sounds like he's going to be okay. Just a lot of pain, obviously. Uh, there are uh, videos and pictures of the tree that fell on him. I, I don't know if that's legit, the tree that fell on him, but if it, it would make sense. You know, it, Big John's a pretty, obviously a big dude, and it would take a big tree to hurt him. So uh, if you are on Twitter, um, you know, I would say send out some support to, to Big John McCarthy. I believe it's uh, John McCarthy MMA. Uh, so at John McCarthy MMA on Twitter. Just send out some love and support for him. He also does a podcast called Weighing In uh, with uh, Josh Thompson, who's a former strike, waist, uh, strike, strike Force lightweight world champion. Uh, you know, send some support out to the, to the show as well. Uh, so I would say just send some support out to Big John. He's, uh, like I said, I think the best referee in the history of the sport. Uh, there are some good referees out in MMA, but he was kind of like a bright spot in MMA as far as refereeing goes when he had a lot of bad referees that, uh, as contemporaries. Uh, people like, you know, Steve Mazzagatti and Mario Yamasaki. So he, uh, you know, so send some love and support out to him. Also, if you are a fan of MMA and you are not following Wayne in, they are not paying me for this, obviously. But if you are a fan of MMA and you are uh, and you want to get information, the Wayne in podcast is great. Uh, I definitely recommend it. Uh, don't bet on their predictions. I'll just put it that way. But um, they give a lot of good insight, both from a uh, referee standpoint and from a fighter standpoint. I think those are the two best ways to understand uh, understand the sport as far as the fighting of it goes. A little bit of the business part of it as well, but yeah, you get a you get a really good take on it, and uh, I definitely I definitely recommend subscribing to that channel on YouTube and getting an idea of what of what the sport is. If you don't know much about MMA, I definitely recommend getting into the sport. I've I've had three amateur fights. Uh, the reason why I never went pro was because I wasn't good enough. I was awful. Um, and getting punched in the face repeatedly <laughs> doesn't sound like fun if you're not good at it. Uh, so I definitely am always going to be a fan of the sport. So uh, if you're not a fan of MMA, I, defer I definitely recommend giving it a shot. And the Wayne In Podcast is a good place to do that. So uh, that's my, my take on that. Go and check out. Uh, show some love for Big John McCarthy. And uh, I will talk to you guys in a little bit. Thanks.